Yo, it's time. The Lyle and Eric Menendez story. Let's not see any spoilers. If you are on my second channel, Triple Nate Live, well, this is the second channel. If you're on my other channel, my third channel, Triple Nate Live, you would have seen my trailer reaction to this. Some of you are probably from that channel. What's up? We're here. It's time. I'm excited, man. Blame it on the rain. First episode. Monsters. The Lyle and Eric Menendez story following up from Dharma's. Dharma monsters. I, I kind of like, I saw the trailers, so I know what the trailers have given me, and I've also seen a few comments on my videos and and that video as well, and some and some reactions explaining who they are. I know that they are two brothers. Obviously, they killed their parents. Apparently, their parents were very very bad to them. Abuse, sexual abuse, all kinds of abuse. Probably every single one you can think of. And I think at the time they were like deemed as like these fucking demons and they're like dude they killed their parents they're fucked up but then later down the line we were they, it was revealed that their parents were actually on some dickhead shit <laughs> we, to, to put it fucking lightly but yeah i'm i'm excited about the acting in this we got that guy from dune he's in a lot of shit i, I, I should know his name but he's i know him from dune that's where i last seen him from um and he's a fucking sick actor i've also seen him in um i seen him in no no country for old men and i was like i was looking like is that even the same guy in that film because he's just so different in that film and he's fucking crazy so i know he's got range that guy in it so i'm excited to see him too much talking too much talking we're going to get into this and see what it is saying the lyle and eric menendez story episode one bow oh -ho -ho -ho! <laughs> Stop fucking with me, nigga. I got pizza here, by the way, and I'm gonna eat it. Sorry. That was a deep to them, innit? That was a deep one. That, was a -dum. that shit one. Alright, okay. For sure. Oh, this is afterwards. Look. Another TCBY. This is after they did it, because I remember in the trailer. Freaking no mind. Exactly what I want to do with Mr. Buffalo. Everywhere that there's a TCBY, there should be a Mr. Buffalo across the street. Honey, you mark what I want to do. What's TCBY? Wire. Could you put on fucking Kiss FM? Damn, this guy's crazy. My words. You can't deal with the silence. Could you put on fucking Kiss FM? I just feel like I gotta tell this fucking guy every time. And music, that's the other thing. Mr. Buffalo customer he comes in to eat wings. Chill, right? Is that his business or something? Are those dad's shoes? Are you wearing his shoes? Yeah. Yeah, we gotta fill his shoes now, right? He's gonna snap, he's gonna snap to you. Listen to me. You're not fucking doing this right now. It's all right. It's all right. I love you. I love you. Okay. He's gotta be older. Lives gotta be older than us now, right? And they would be proud of us. Tell me. He's crying as well. Then I think that they would be proud of us. That's crazy that they're saying that because they were literally assholes to them. <coughs> like the parents were to the kids. It's right up here. Hey, hey, hey! Fucking stop the car! Back! No, 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 no. You're dropping us at the curb. It's just a big crowd out front. Well, then fucking run them over. He's acting like how his father was acting in the trailers, bro. I don't give a fuck. Did the mafia kill your parents? What? I don't know. It certainly appears as such, but that's what we gotta find out. Are you oh. afraid the mafia could come after you? Oh. Yeah. Mafia, after what we've been through, I'd like to see you try. Okay. Oh. Come on. Come on. What the fuck? Okay. They lied about him. They said the mafia did it, yeah? Hey, where's your camera? That's mad. No way. I, 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 thought, this was like, I thought this was like the aftermath of like they've been found out. I'm like, I'm like, um. Yo, I thought this was like the ultimate they even found out. This is like them dealing with the fucking press and shit of everyone knowing that they killed their parents. Bro, it's a secret. Really need you to get right. They must have planned it out. Why would you say, oh, I'll have to see you try to the mafia though? That's gonna make it obvious, bro. The mafia will collapse your thing, fam. That's making it obvious that like it wasn't them. Not obvious, but you know what I'm saying? People gonna be like, what the fuck kind of response is that? The mafia. It's one of my favorite images of my mom. <laughs> Just how she cared for the birds. Legend. Captain of industry. Husband, tennis coach. Most men could only dream of being one of these things, but Jose Menendez was all of them. <laughs> this shit fake as hell. Mantle. I don't like this combat angle. And be the if dad was our foundation, well, mom, you were the wallpaper and the beautiful furnishings. Tragedy. 
lips quivering, bro. Chat to me, man. Chat to me. This is LA, yeah? 989. I'm here. Oh, they were rich one day. over two months since the brutal murders of Jose and Kitty Menendez. But oh, so far, the police don't seem to be any closer to finding their killers. Bro. But Detective Les Zoller with the... Whoever committed these senseless and heinous killings is behind bars. It's his dad or something, isn't it? He's out. Pretty slow start, pretty slow start. I ain't gonna lie, pretty slow start. It's gonna be where they killed them, isn't it? Oh! Is sweating. He's gonna cry. Oh yeah, they told they telling the therapist about that shit as well. Doctor Ozil speaking. Ozeal. Sounds good. Okay, I'll I'll see you then. He looks familiar, this guy, and he sounds familiar. Guys, look at things. Shit, none of your lives is chilling, bro. Have a seat, Eric. Come in. Suicidal. Okay. Suicidal is crazy though. Um, like the suicide in general though, like, it's just mad. No one's Anyone that's going through that, I hope you get through it, man, for real. Listen, you can't tell anybody what I tell you. Do you think we could just go for a walk, maybe? Just been having these nightmares, like, every night about my mom and my dad. And again, and kids dressed up like Michael Jackson from Thriller. <laughs> it's going quite far. I don't know about the pace of this. It's cool, though, but it's like, I just, I, I need a bit more time. What? What are you dressed as? What? I'm Tom Cruise. Is this the house where those parents got... Got what? Shot. How about you get the fuck off my property before I shove that fucking Snickers bar all the way up your ass, cowboy? Damn. Okay, Lyle, what the hell's he on? What's going on, Eric? We did it, my brother and I. <gasps> You shot them. <laughs> okay, um, you think maybe we should we should go back to the office and, and talk about it. Do you feel any better what? after having told me that? I don't like how he was like so shocked and then he he just cuts it scene and he's calm. We miss I feel like I missed that whole bit. And I wanted to see his full reaction, you know what I'm saying? Not just a cut scene that he's like, okay, I've accepted it, now let's talk about it, that's dead. I just need to talk, I was watching this movie, Billionaire Boys Club. It's about these kids who had these rich parents and they killed them. It seemed exactly like our lives. So we quickly made a plan. You just, you watched a movie and you decided to kill your parents, Eric. Parasite is a very, very serious course of action to take. That's what it's called, Parasite. What's parasite? When you kill your parents. <clears throat> There's abuse. Well, they don't know my dad. What the fuck was that? What the fuck was that? What the fuck are you doing, Eric? Jesus, dude. What have we been working on? Fuck! Jesus! Mr. Menendez, no, 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 you fucking touch me! <laughs> he came on to the. <laughs> Holy shit, hold on, they're gonna He can't handle it, fam. He cannot handle it. What the fuck was that? What have we been working on? <laughs> Jesus! Mr. Menendez! Just Eric! Hold the fucking position! <laughs> you your father. Ew. Physically. He abusive. went onto the fucking court, though. I told him to do it. I've never even seen that. Man, fuck! I cannot believe you go to Princeton. That was a bad call. But go! But go! Domineering. I'm here for this. And why would you kill your mom? What? Addicted to our dad. He had an affair and she started drinking a lot. Taking these pills, sign that her life had no value. Putting her out of her misery. Mm. 
Fuck you, Lucy. Now, oh, Reese, I'm shaking. Okay, okay. Fuck you, What are you going to do about it? What, what are you going to do about, about it, Dad? Are you going to fucking hit me? I'll tell you what. I'll tell you what. I want you to fucking hit me right now. Shut the fuck up. Don't Let's see it, old man. Let's see it, old man. Come on. They just wouldn't stop. And then... You're gonna fucking hit me! I'll tell you what! I'll tell you what! I want you to fucking hit me right now! Shut the f- That nigga Lyle, yo! Plagiarism. Yeah, this octa, bro, is crazy. You're gonna fucking hit me! Let's see it on me! Come on! I love her, and I think that you should understand, Mom. You're 20 years old. You are not getting married. No way! Uh-uh! Why should I listen to you two when you got married at exactly my age? She's a whore! You're a hypocrite, and I don't care what you say. I'm marrying her. Hypocrite? Don't you dare call me that. Family and is not going to happen. No. Not in a minute. I like what they're doing here. I am trying to save no, you. No, I'm going to say when you hypocrite. did exactly the same thing when you were my age, Mom. You are the <laughs> hypocrite, huh? What about this? Oh! 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 oh. 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 Oh! 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 Shit, nigga! Oh, fuck! Even the dad said, "Yo, chill. That's enough. That was mad." Oh my god! That's crazy. You're a hypocrite. I was. Oh my god! I was. Okay, cool. Fucking up. I was gonna fucking up. So what I was gonna say was, I like how they're doing this back and forth, back and forth right now. This is, I like, I, I like this storytelling right now. This is good. I like, I'm liking this. I'm enjoying this. But fucking you're hell! You're a hypocrite, and I don't care what you say. You don't get to say when you did exactly the same thing when you were my age, mom. You are Yo, this, this is, huh? no, it's so cold though because it's like, ah, oh, this is hard. This is hard. This is hard. This is hard. This is so cold because this is really what like life could be like with with families behind closed doors, bro. Like. Obviously, this is the parents are on some crazy shit. Everyone's on some crazy shit in this, in it. But like, people can get to this level of like emotion, bro. But you never see it, fam. You never see it. It's always in the yard, and niggas don't even see it. Oh, oh, oh! Look at the mom laughing, you know. Even the dad kissed it. Oh, that's that is so. That's looking the most. That's why. That's why. That's the most uncomfortable thing I've seen throughout this whole thing so far. Yeah, he, he ain't got no hair. He got, it was just like alopecia or something. G.I. Jane, nigga. That is mad. He's 20 years old and he's lost his hair. How long have you had that? He didn't even know. He didn't even know. Like, uh, years ago? I didn't know that. His, his own mom did that, though. Jamie doesn't even know. It's a hair replacement. That boy can't take it, nigga. <laughs> something about Fuck, that. Fuck, man. Fuck, man. <laughs> my brother. Fuck you, know. Fuck you, know, man. man. Right. That Lyle acts as hard. This it's guy's hard as well, but that Lyle, the guy that plays Lyle is different. He's different. And his mom just ripped it off. Dad made me. And I suddenly saw how cruel it was. I finally told him. What? What did you tell him? I loved him. That's a lie. And that from now on, I was always going to choose my brother over my parents. I think that's a lie. Is that when it all changed for you, that moment? I haven't seen enough Gravity. for me to know what, for, for so me to be that, yeah. Gun store in West LA. Killed her parents. I know that's a two -week Obviously never killed her parents. Wait, though, what? Though. It's in the Constitution! I mean, just my fake. Fuck! And these would be good against intruders? I haven't seen nah, the American thing is mad. They got guns. Happened. Okay, and then... I think throughout the whole, the rest of the season, they're going to explain to me more of what happened with the parents, isn't it? Because I, I haven't gotten enough. For to be like, oh fuck, they fucking deserved it. Yeah. Okay. That's what I'm saying. America's mad. You just go and buy a fucking gun, bro. What the fuck is wrong with this place? I'm sorry, but shout out to America, isn't it? But bro, why can you buy a gun in America, bro? Why can civilians just go and buy a gun? Do you know how mad that fucking is? There is no guns allowed in the UK, and I'm glad. I don't feel the weight of it yet, to be honest. Like, it's it's cool to watch, but I don't feel enough weight right now. I don't feel the weight. When I was watching Dharma, I felt the weight. I don't feel weight right now. It's not what they're gonna I'm about to do, but I don't feel the weight of it. I don't think it's even down to the acting. I think it's down to the directing. I haven't seen enough of the parents for me to see this scene. I'm not gonna lie. I haven't. Oh my god. Oh, 
I can't believe they're showing me this. I can't believe I'm seeing this here right now. Oh! That was such a real fucking scene. Oh my gosh. I cannot believe it. I can't believe it. I've just, I can't believe how desensitized we are to fucking films and shows. I just seen a nigga, I just seen a nigga get killed, bro. I've never seen that in my life. In real life. But like, I just seen it. I'm chilling. Cause the show. I'm detaching from real. But like, I'm not gonna lie though, that might stay with me. Because that's the realest thing I've that's the realest like killing I've ever seen ever. Honestly. And I'm just you know what I'm saying, chilling. But th that is actually probably the realest killing like that like, they they were just getting up from it, like, what the fuck? Uh, and I seen the shot like I've never I don't know how shotguns look in real life, but that looks pretty real to me. I might watch that again. They did it. <laughs> Yo. They're not even wearing gloves though, what the fuck? Like, they see, they, their fingerprints are everywhere. You know what I mean? The fuck? Pick up the shells. So wait, so do you think maybe their privilege is what's allowed them to do this as well? But I'm thinking that they would just like, that their parents just fucked them up differently. That's why they're doing it. But like, maybe like they were, they, maybe obviously their parents were bad and they were fucked up parents for sure. But like, is it their privilege just going thinking, no, we can't fucking have this shit. We live in a big match. We can do what the fuck we want. Like, let's kill these niggas. Is it that? Cause like, no. They're like, they're living pretty sweet, like, prior to, I mean, uh, yeah, prior to, I mean, uh, after the aftermath, like, in terms of their house and what their riches and shit, their life is pretty good and stress-free, but, you know, that like, would it be as bad as someone who doesn't have a stress-free, like, lifestyle to kill their abusive parents? You know what I'm saying? Even, even if they were that abusive, would they still Are do Are you it? having trouble hearing? 9.50 screening of Batman. Yeah, but it's 10.40 now. Fuck it, let's just go to Taste of L.A. Fuck Wild. it, oh. What are we doing? Is this Edom? Yeah, it's a smoked Edom. Amy is what it is. Here, Eric. I'm making sure that people see us. There's no one here. Somebody killed my parents. What the fuck kind of therapist are you? I came here to feel better. I came here so that you tell me I'm not a bad person. Tell me I'm not a bad person. Eric is not... not. Eric's not as good as an actor as Lyle. Lyle's a better actor. She's, he's just crying, Bez. He's I'm good at it, though. I nightmares, and I can't sleep. I've seen him cry about 50 times. I'm yeah. living in a house that I shot my parents in. I think we should call Lyle, and I think he should come here right now. Can I get another one? What the fuck are you talking about? <laughs> Those are king-size Snickers, you know. Hello. Lyle. I want you to come into the office. Eric's here. He's told me everything. What? No, put him on the phone. Put my fucking brother on the phone right now! And you can talk to him in person. This is important. Fuck it! <laughs> I think he's on his way down. <laughs> Leave. I'll be right back. You're gonna trust him. You keep going to the cops, nigga. Oh. Come on, come on, come on. Eric just confessed to the murder. So just get here now. Why didn't you call her Jay? Who the hell's this woman? Come on, 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 Fuck did you tell him? Lyle, have a seat. Shut the fuck up, I'm not talking to you. What did you say to him? What did oh. you tell him? Huh? About we don't know who killed them. I told him everything. Okay. Everything about what? How the mafia, how the mob probably did it. They had to tell somebody everything. Okay, well I don't know what the fuck that means he told me everything because I don't know what the fuck everything is and just because he fucking said it doesn't mean that it's fucking true. Lyle, he shot them. This shit, this shit. You see this nigga Lyle's acting, it's gonna go down. It's, it's, it's gonna be, it's gonna, He's gonna be big, this guy. Oh, uh, now she knows. Who the fuck was that? Was that? I have no idea. This office is sound. She's lying. Sit. Tell me how it's okay if Eric and I killed our fucking parents. You don't have a gun, do you? 
This is well, confidential. All, Anything you someone. say here, it's confidential. You told someone, though. You Everything. Prick. Fuck down, Eric. I don't even know what the fuck I'm supposed to do with you right now. I don't know who the fuck you are. Ah, <laughs> 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 oh, he's sick. You say he's here, sick, this guy. This guy's so cold. Fuck you are. I don't have a brother. Just needed to tell somebody. Well, then you fucking tell me. You fucking tell me. I mean, fuck. Why the fuck? Fuck! Would you make up something like this, Eric? It's not make a up. lie. Oh, Lyle. we did it. He's wilding. I mean, obviously they're wild. <laughs> they're wilding for doing it. Yeah, yeah. Will you shut the fuck up, Doctor Zeal? Shut the out. fuck up and let me think. Nobody was ever gonna fucking find out, Eric. And he would have been proud, even. He would have been fucking proud. You said so. Now he's gonna start crying again. <laughs> I ain't fucking with him. Stop crying again. This nigga's just crying, no, bro. Action. What are you gonna do now? Okay. <sighs> All right. Okay. He, he even looks like his dad. I'll drive you. They both look like their parents, which is sick. Like, he does have the mom. The young ones have the mom. He does have the dad for him. Even that's like the dad, the older one. We know what we have to do now. What? Here for it. Here for it. I'm here, I'm here for it. It started off a bit rocky. I was like, what the fuck? But then it, it like heated up. And the acting got fire. So, yeah. Especially from Lyle. I, I even said it in the trailer, bro. Lyle, that guy might be, he might be, yo, he, he, he might be around for a, long, for a long time, that guy. I would not be surprised if the brother that plays Lyle is not, is around for, is around for a long time. As an actor, he's fucking serious. The fucking parent. I'm in, I'm so interested in how the parents in their relationship with the parents because he was even Lyle's character in, in that flashback. Like they were arguing. Like he was arguing. He was, he, like they, it, the parents were like abusive and like strict, but like they were able to like talk back to them, which is mad. Which I wasn't expecting. I thought it'd be like a thing where like they would never even think about it. But yeah, there was a lot of arguments. He was like, "Come on, old man. Come on, old man." You know. Anyway. Let me edit this so I can get it out for you. You don't come watch it peacefully and happily, yeah? If you enjoyed the reactions, subscribe to the channel. Roll to the K. See you in a bit, man. And episode two is coming soon. Peace.